My name is Mark Slade, and I am not a murderer. Six months ago, I acted in a short film called The Lost Art of Cadaver Collecting. Uh, my co-star, Stella Epstein, who I murdered in the film, went missing shortly after the production. The police found evidence of her murder at the filming location, and so now we will wait here until this whole thing blows over. To whoever is watching this, my name is Nick. I wrote and directed the short film Lost Art of Cadaver Collecting about six months ago. The reason we're out here is that man, Mark Slade. He... He killed his co-star, Stella Epstein, uh, which I'm complicit in. Right before we ended shooting, he got to me and he, and he said that he was gonna kill her, and... I wasn't sure what we were supposed to do, so I naturally did what any rational person would do. And I rewrote the entire script and accommodated for that. And now he's... He's besmirched our name. And I hope to expose our crimes. And maybe seek a little bit of justice. I do miss my family, though. It's been a long time since I've seen anybody but Nick's face. And I am starting to get tired of that pompous bastard. I try to get in touch from time to time, and it's worth it, even though it's awful. I just wanted to take a minute to, to thank my camera crew for joining me in this endeavor. Anyway, I truly believe that this will put me up there with the greats. Think about it. This is the first time a director has made a documentary exposing their own crimes. The Maker Martyr Enemy. I am a victim here and I think this really shows some bravery. But if we are going to complete this, we're going to have to do it all the way. We need evidence of Mark Slade's heinous crimes. And yours. As thank well. you. And mine too. Do I have that yet? No. But I have faith that I will. And sometimes faith is the, the greatest, the uh, best weapon one can have. Once a week, Nick and I, we have dinner to kind of gauge things in our predicaments. Yeah, they're going. Uh, we set the table up all nice, we sit down, we discuss our most pressing issues. What? Never mind. Um... Hey, <coughs> is there... Oh, hello, sir. Can we help? What are you guys doing here? Uh, eating. Why? This is private property. You guys can't be here. Oh, well. well can look, we at least finish eating. I'm gonna call the cops on you guys if you don't leave. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We'll, we'll leave. Uh, we'll go. Can, can I? Can I take this with me? All right. All right. Take these though. What? I'm about to call it. Yeah. No. We're going. We're going. <laughs> Where are we supposed to go now? I don't know. Dude, I mean, we can't go home. Yep. Wait, I think Abigail's parents are out of town. You think we could just go there? That's true. Uh, do you want me to call her? Yeah, just call her. Give us see what okay. Seven months ago, I acted in this short film for my friend Nick. I don't really remember the name, uh, but we've talked a little since then. So as you can imagine, I was just overjoyed when Mark called me. Stella disappeared around the same time as the movie, I think. Uh, the investigation's only been going on for like a week.
to find something. Mark kept a journal of everything he did, including his murder of Stella. He stashed it here so the cops wouldn't find it. What are you doing? Nothing. I couldn't find the bathroom. Uh, you were satisfied with the full operation. I wonder who is you, my boy. You think I don't you're stupid speaking to the camera? And you're a murderer. I want justice for it. You are just as complicit in this as I am. No, no. I don't care anymore. Well, if we can't have written proof of the murder, let's just get the body.